Hello there newcomers of Pilato. If you're a newcomer to Pilato.com, then look no further because this tutorial, along with several others, will help you become a pro at creating games and editing them on our website. Now that you're ready, let's get started. First and foremost, you'll want to begin the skeleton of your Pilato game. You'll do this by clicking the Create Level button, which will direct you to the game editing box, as you see here. In this box are all of the tools in which you will begin brainstorming and plotting ideas for your game. On the left side of this box are several templates to base your game on. You can scroll down and preview, preview which games best fit your criteria, and then from then on you can get really creative. Now that you have chosen the game you want to base yours on, you can begin naming and describing your games. Please note that your game, although it should and probably will have many of the same attributes as the game you chose, does not have to be exactly like the game you chose to base yours off of. For example, I chose Snakes and Hoes, but I named my game Ants at the Picnic, and it was adventure, but I made it into an action. Also, my description is quite different from the original Snakes and Hoes description, that being that it's about ants now, invading a picnic, and not much is same about it at all. Also, you'll want to tag and name the keywords and elements of your game, mine being ants, picnic, food, etc. You also can credit yourself. It's not necessary, you don't have to, but you can. But do not stress about major details though because throughout your creation process you can go back and edit the fields you want and wish to edit. So you can save and look at your game to see exactly what it's about what you do with it and then you can begin brainstorming ideas figuring out exactly what you want to do with your game and that will help you a lot with the next tutorial that we're going to do so I'll leave you here so you play your game and we'll get back in the next tutorial